Hot Squile to know ya. Here is a short eye movie on Did You Know about the book West Imats Quis West Hal How to Write the Squamish Language. This is the late Dr. Chief Louis Miranda. He did a lot of language work for our people. According to the beginning speaker's book, Tsomt Wanachem, How to Write Squamish Language, West Imats Quis West Hal. There are 42 meaningful sound differences that we must be able to express in writing down the Squamish language. Of the 26 symbols available from the English alphabet, we will only use 16 symbols plus the number 7. The remaining symbols for the Squamish alphabet are obtained by using three special markings. We use three special markings in Squamish language. We use the apostrophe. An apostrophe beside the symbol represents special Squamish sounds that are strongly exploded. An apostrophe above the symbol to represent special Squamish sounds that are weakly exploded. A line under the symbol represent special squamish sounds that are produced relatively further back in the mouth. A W beside the symbol represents special squamish sounds that are produced with rounded lips. A stress mark. We will stress over the vowel that is pronounced the loudest in all squamish words containing two vowels or more. We can divide the symbols for Squamish sounds into six different groups. Group one is the same as English. Group two are the vowels. Group three are the special sounds. Group four are the glottalized sounds. Group five are the sounds further back in the mouth. And group six are the rounded lip sounds.